Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my United Career Mode, and welcome to the Season 1 Finale. Today, we have the second leg against Atalanta to play. Currently, it is a 1-1 draw between both teams. So, I think we don't have the away goal advantage here, so we need to really perform. Uh, there's the team, some of them are tired. We have to balance it here between this and also our Premier League match against Manchester City. It's difficult, yes, but I think we can beat City and Atalanta. So it's, it's going to be difficult. Skrnal is going to be the one who's very tired, unless we put Diogo Dalot. We have to do Diogo Dalot this game and also Ahmad Diallo. But I think we could beat Atlanta. It's just a matter of uh, how good the players perform in this game. But let's get right into the press conference. So there we go now. Currently in Italy for this. Uh, it's going to be a big fight. We need to win this match. But, do we think we can win? Absolutely. The people that we have. Timo Verde and Sancho have been on fire. Sancho's not going to start this game though, so. It's going to be difficult, but I believe we can win. 100%. That's the team they have to use against us. A 3 4 2 1. But. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get into Manchester United versus Atalanta. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We're here at the Stadio Platico for the semi finals of the Champions League. We should win this by a mile. Here we go, you see here right now Liverpool are beating Barcelona, two goals to nil. And Man United and Atalanta are drawing, so it looks like Liverpool might be in the finals, along with us or Atalanta. And like Diallo started his first Champions League game. But here we go. Diogo Dalla and Luke Shaw as the centre back to this game. Dean Henderson, the goalkeeper. And of course, you can't have a Manchester United team without the captain. And today it is Bruno Fernandes. The There's the last, last starting lineup. Jerome Boateng and Samuel Lomtiti at the back of them have been very dangerous. Sergio Romero, we swapped them to him early in the season. Mayfrey and Gozans. We have to watch out for the wide midfielders here today because they are very deadly. We need to win this. squad that are going to be taking us into the finals hopefully as you see there good team 4-2-3-1 very attacking 4-2-3-1 as well may I add this will not be an easy task for us in the slightest but it will not be difficult for us either so let's get this matchup underway Atalanta versus Manchester United no Boateng gets it to Muriel to Freuler, to Mehne, to Malinowski, and it goes straight to Alex Tellers, who gets to Diogo Dalot, to Yuri Kelmans, to Bruno Fernandes, who gets it to Timo Werner, sees Donny van der Beek on the run, can van der Beek get past Jerome Boateng, looking likely as Bruno Fernandes finds Timo Werner, and it's a goal! 
four, Manchester United within five minutes. Timo Werner starts off the match with his eighth goal of the competition. Put him up to 35 in all competitions. Maybe 40, I'm not too sure yet. But that is another cracking goal by the German. Top right corner. Just confirm that is Timo Werner's eighth goal in the Champions League. And it's Man United 1, Atalanta 0. The Italian fans are not happy right now. I, I wouldn't be either. Hold on a second. Again. Let's observe there's a bit of a problem. There we go. But. Oh, the open space. Alex Tellers was pushing too far up here. Oh, Froehler. And Luke Shaw with the block. And. Diogo Dalot again gets the ball, gets it to Rashford. Can Rashford spot the open space? He does. Can he get past Samuel Umtiti? Looks like he may be able to. Oh, Rashford gets it past him, and Marcus Rashford nearly goes in, but with a beautiful save by Gallini. Rashford flip flaps it around Samuel Umtiti and the keeper stretching out like Stretch Armstrong to get the ball and it is a Manchester United corner kick and here we go Luke Shaw nearly got it and it is out for another corner and it's in converting it, his head on it, no and it's out for a free, a goal kick Uh, it's kicked up. Charles tells get his head on it. No, Mehle does. Gets it to Freuler, who gets it to Devan. Get it to Baranchuk. And over the side to Gozens. They'll do this last game, they'll do the same things. Oh. Kelmans to Alex Tellez. Marcus Rashford. That was a beautiful ball by Tellez. Oh, Rashford with the rainbow flick. Rashford again with the rainbow flick and it's out for a corner. And floated in. Kalunch will get his head on it. Oh, it's off the post. Sorry, the crossbar. And Muriel to collect the ball for Atalanta. Moranchuk to Devan. To Froiler, but Luke Shaw gets it. And it's to Umtiti. To Romero. Froiler now to Muriel and again another ball to Gozens anyone you can find in the box Luke Shaw with the tackle and it's a penalty Luke Shaw carded and it looks like it's going to be a red card for the Man United centre back that weren't a red card but here we go And Henderson saves it. Henderson saving the penalty. Beautiful save. Knocking it out. And it will be an Atalanta corner kick. The, the danger of the Atalanta attack is not over. But now it is. Henderson with a beautiful penalty save. Keeps Man United in the running to go into the finals. Pavard gets it to Ahmad Diallo. What could Diallo do here? Oh, he tries to get past Boateng, but it's failed. As the patter on the ball to Froehler, to Malinowski. To Froehler, to Moranchuk. Fires the ball to Malinowski! It's out for another goal kick. Dean Henson kicking it upfield. Van de Beek gets ahead on it. Rashford's on the ball now. What can he do here? Catches Bruno Fernandes on a run. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, Bruno Fernandes tried to turn on Titi, but he just had a slight connection with the ball. And it's out for a Man United throw in. Straight to Fernandes. To Rashford. Rashford with 
another rainbow flick. And Borte takes the ball. Muriel on the ball. Could Benjamin Pavard catch him? Dean Henderson coming out and he saves it. Dean Henderson proving vital today. To Man United success. And the referee plays advantage to Bruno Fernandes tackle. Oh, nice interception by Dalot gets it to yellow, but it's back to Gozens, who gets it to Moranchuk. And Van der Beek gets the ball. Can he get it to Timo Werner? Not on Titi. Beating the Dutchman. Devard on the ball here. Gets it to Malinowski. Open space, and Pavard intercepts. Van der Beek to Yuri Tielemans, who gets it to Marcus Rashford. Rashford gets past Mehne. Oh, Rashford. Rashford needs a bit of support, and Alex Hell is giving it to him. Straight to Yuri Tielemans, who gets it to Bruno Fernandes. And it's another save by Gallini. It looks like a Man United corner kick here. As Rashford calling for Bruno Fernandes to help him in the corner. As he does. Bruno Fernandes on the ball. Turns his man and is out for a throw in for Man United. To Benjamin Pavard. To Donny van der Beek. To Timo Werner. Oh, off the bar! Timo Werner with the last chance of the first half, I presume, but to pass on the run. Devon to Potter and Diogo Dalot gets it, kicks it out for half time. What a first half. Dean Henderson has been absolutely amazing. The saves he has done this game have been on point. But we are now into the second half. And we will be bringing on Mason Greenwood. For this second half, a bit more, a bit more up tempo for the attack here. Van der Beek to Benjamin Pavard, who gets it over to Diogo Dalo, to Alex Tellers, to Marcus Rashford. Rashford back to Tellemans. Tellemans going over to Marcus Rashford. Ah, oh, Mehele gets the ball, but Rashford's back past him. Oh, Rashford with him. Shot and it's gone out. Oh, Teller's going to get the ball. No. The other Dalot. He's left a space open. Zapata. Oh, brilliant save by Henderson. Zapata. The, the Atalanta attack cannot defeat the English goalkeeper tonight. And it was out for an Atalanta corner. It's whipped in and Ahmad Diallo hits it out. Miranchuk on the ball here to Gozens and Alex Tellez heads it. Oh, Malinowski tries it to Pavard to Diogo Dalot and it's out for a Manchester United throw in. Getting it to Pavard to Diallo. Diallo to Van der Beek who gets it back to Diallo to Bruno Fernandes who gets it to Chelmans. Can he get over to Marcus Rashford? Looks like he does. Oh, Rashford on the outside of box. Marcus Rashford and it's hit off Samuel Umtiti. And it's offside. Hmm. Romero gets it over. But Van der Beek heads it down. Could Greenwood get the ball? <clears throat> it's like Mehnir's on the ball now. To Freuler. Van der Beek looks like he's got a bad shoulder there. Oh, no. Miranchuk's coming off now. Madiella passes it to Donny van der Beek, who is a bit injured here. Oh, and it's over to Darun. Interception. Froiler back to Darun. To Devan. To Froiler. Van der Beek trips up one of the Atalanta defenders. Andy Henderson saves the ball. 
Throwing it over to Ahmad Diallo, but it's intercepted by Gozens. I need, I need to take off Van der Beek here. I can't risk him getting more injured. So Ryan Ravenberg is going to come on. <coughs> oh, it's whipped over to Gozens again. Who gets it to Muriel. Back up to Gozens. And Pavard gets the ball. Ahmad Diallo looks a bit free here. But he passes it inside to Van der Beek. Who passes it to Greenwood. To T. Elements. Yuri T. Elements is on a run here. And he tries to knock the ball off a bit. But he's intercepted by Boateng to Mehle. To Malinowski. Gets it to Froehler. Who gets it to Devon Zapata. <coughs> Froehler. Froehler's going to be through here. No. Dalot with the interception. And Chelmans is on the ball here. Getting it to Bruno Fernandes. Who sees Donny van der Beek. Who gets it to Mason Greenwood. And it's knocked out of to the Atlanta attack here to Devon Zapata. Who gets it over to Mehle. Oh, it's whipped in. And it's out. Muriel had too much pressure from Benjamin Pavard there. It's out for a goal kick. Who taken off the bank for Gravenberg to reduce injuries here tonight. As Ahmad Diallo looks like he's going to go for it. Whips it in and it's off the head of Jerome, not Jerome Boateng, Samuel Umtiti. And it's over to Mehle, who gets it to Ilikic. Gets it over to Devon Zapata and it's open wide for Muriel. Benjamin Pavard watching him and it's out for Atalanta throwing. Golders is coming off for Stefan. And see, so they're doing subs, we could do one as well. Or two. As we will bring on D'Souza for Rashford. And we will bring on Milan Scranar for Diogo Dalot. Nope, never mind. Let's bring it on D'Souza. The Champions League debut for the youngster. Also, we have a Manchester derby coming up in a couple of days, so we want to get as much fuel in the tank for our best players. It's out for a corner here. It's over. And Henderson knocks it out. Ahmad Diallo on the ball here. Oh, it's hit out. And Ahmad Diallo heads it down. Raven Birch gets the ball to Benjamin Pavard, who has a bit of clear air here. Gets it to Ahmad Diallo, who... Gets it to Graven Birch, to Greenwood. What can Greenwood do with it? Greenwood can get past on TT. It looks like he can. Mason Greenwood shoots! And it's Mason Greenwood! In the 85th minute! Who secured a Champions League final spot for Manchester United. What a run. Gets past on TT and Boateng. Finally. And it's shot in the top right corner again. Beautiful strike by the youngster. And that Mason, is Mason Greenwood's second goal in the Champions League. And it's Manchester United 2. I slab to 1 and that has surely got to secure my United in the Champions League final. Froehler over to Muriel. Can Muriel get Pat Souza? Looks like he is, but Alex Tellers hits it out. Mehle. Oh, Illy kicks with the header and Dean Henson brings it down. It was offside, apparently. Pass it up to Pavard. Passing it back <coughs> to Henderson. Passes it to Dalot. He gets it over to Souza. D'Souza on the run here down the side. D'Souza in a lot of open space here. And it is full time. Manchester United are advancing 
to the Champions League final. Fair play to Atalanta today. They broke down our defence easily, but they could not get past that man, the number one, Dean Henderson. Dean Henderson is surely going to be one of the man of the matches here tonight. As it's Manchester United 2, Atalanta 0. So ladies and gentlemen, after that game, let's hope we have a good one here. Uh, you can do even better for me. Yeah. Five days with a bruised shoulder. Luke Shaw's picked up a suspension. We don't really need Luke Shaw as long as our team is fit. Here we are. It's match day, and Mason Greenwood been playing pretty well. You don't want to be on the bench, okay? I'll think about it. I mean, Mason Greenwood has been on form lately. Oh, there's no denying that. And our team looks pretty much fully fit, except from Pavard. Yeah, the Sancho obviously fit. So are the centre backs of uh, Skrinar and Diash. But this game, it looks like we'll play Ryan Graven Birch. But yeah, we decided to play D'Souza today. Um, let's just put all of our uh, youth players up top here so we can kind of have more free range of uh, what's what. There we go. But yeah, I think this might be the team that we're going to against Manchester City. Actually, Alex, Benjamin Pavard's a bit low. So we're going to put in him. We're going to take off Tellers for the first game, first half of it. But the rest of the team looks pretty sorted. Rashford's a bit tired, so we might have to take him off for D'Souza in the second half. <clears throat> but... I think we're ready to face off against Manchester City. Last time we played him, I think we won, so... Thank you all for joining us. We'll start the questions now. One win away from lifting the title. Okay. I mean, if we win this Manchester derby, we are Premier League champions guaranteed. Granted, I would have liked to have finished the Premier League off a tad bit sooner to kind of focus on the uh, Champions League a little bit. But it is what it is, and today we have that chance. Okay, both teams very strong. I can see a massive gap in the defence right in the middle. Rodri ain't the fastest, so Greenwood and Rashford can really get in between and just rush it. Obviously, Walker will have to watch out for because of his pace, he can really overlap. We have Mares. Sterling, obviously we always know it's going to be a problem, but let's get into the Manchester Derby. So here we go. Coming up next, Manchester United are going to be taking on Manchester City. Will we be bleeding blue or bleeding red today? We find out. Hold on a second. Sorry about that, but will we be bleeding blue or red as we are live from Old Trafford?
Last time we played off against Manchester City was at the Etihad and we defeated them. And obviously the player to watch, Jaden Sancho, he has been on form lately. He's really finding his footing in the Manchester United squad. The soon to be number seven has been really working well with Bruno Fernandes and Yuri Tielemans down the left down the right side. And has been able to get in between the defenders like Rashford and really clinically finish off that we need. Sorry about that. But not just Sancho that we have, obviously Marcus Rashford has been clinical. Uh, Mason Greenwood today will also be a clinical man for us. He has to be started this game and this will be his first ever Manchester derby. As Manchester you line up with Dean Henderson, Dalot, Skrinar, Diaz and Shaw. Graham and Birch and Tielemans in midfield with Sancho, Bruno Fernandes and Rashford in the attacking midfield with Mason Greenwood firing the blanks up front. Whilst for Man City they have Edison in the net. Walker, Ake, Sule and Mendy in the defence. Bernardo Silva, Rodri and Kevin De Bruyne in the midfield with Riyad Mahrez, Gabriel Jesus and Raheem Sterling up front in a 4-3-3 holding position. And we are ready for the last Manchester derby of season one and it's underway. Obviously by United through to the Champions League final now defeating the team that knocked out Manchester City in the Champions League, Atalanta. There we go, Sancho on the ball. Can he get past Mendy? It looks like he can. Sancho just running, just with the with the speed. Speed! Mason Greenwood! Gets the ball in the net in the fourth minute. Brilliant assist by Jadon Sancho. And a brilliant counter-attack. Just look at this, Sancho. Like I say, always just cutting into the inside and getting the ball into the box for someone like Mason Greenwood to finish it off. That is Greenwood's ninth goal in the Premier League. What a goal by that youngster. His first goal in the Manchester derby. And a quick start to a game. Like always, as Man United do. As it's Manchester United 1, Manchester City 0. De Bruyne gets it to Rodri. Gets it to Bernardo Silva. And it's whipped over to Raheem Sterling. But it's out for a throw in. Gets it to Milan Skrinar. Oh, it's intercepted. Kevin De Bruyne on the ball here. Kevin De Bruyne flips it past. He tries to shoot, but it's deflected off the foot of Luke Shaw, who's getting it out up the midfield. Ryan Gravenberch on the ball. Chips it over to Jadon Sancho. Can you beat Phil and Mendy? Looks like he can. Goes down the inside. Jadon Sancho! In the net! And Man United are coming into their own here. Quick start, quick attacks. Manchester City just cannot keep up with the likes of Jadon Sancho. As, like I said, there's a big gap in their defence. And we're going to utilise it. And Mason Greenwood and Jadon Sancho are doing just that. Edison, Edison cannot save that. And it's Manchester United 2. Manchester City, nil. And by the looks of this game, this will be the game where we hold up the Premier League trophy. Oh, Raheem Sterling on the side here. All alone, but Diogo Dalot has caught back up. What's going to do here? Oh, Dalot hits out for a corner kick. Dangerous position here. And it's whipped in to the far post. But it's headed out. Mason Green was on the ball. Can he get past Mares? Looks like he can. It looks like Kyle Walker's coming for him. Can Kyle Walker get the ball? And Greenwood. Uh, I thought Walker had the ball there, so I just hold, held X, tried to tackle him, but he actually went out. But it is a Manchester City goal kick. As Edison, Edison hits it up to the left side. Rodri on the ball, gets it to Bernardo Silva, back to Rodri, to Gabriel Jesus. Who, oh, Ruben Diaz gets the ball to Ryan Gravenberg. Jadon Sancho 
Oh, gets over Ferland Bendy. Rodri protected the left side whilst Rod Oh, Ferland. Oh, Rodri. Obstruction there. Gets it to Edison. Gets it to Nathan Ake. Gets it to Ferland Bendy. Gets it to Kevin De Bruyne. To Raheem Sterling. Back to Ferland Bendy. To Nathan Ake. Back to Kevin De Bruyne. And it's over to the side. Oh, and Raheem Sterling on the ball here. Can Milan's going stop him? Not looking likely, and it's chipped in. But it was hit off. Diogo Dalot. Oh, Phil and Manny ran too far. And it looks like Sancho's on his own, unless Kevin De Bruyne can stop him. Oh, Sancho gets past him. Gets it to Bruno Fernandes. And it's a brilliant save by Edison Moraes. Bruno Fernandes took the risk to hit it whilst Luke, whilst Carl Walker was coming to him. It was a good risk, but it is a Mike United corner. Whipped in. Ruben Dias can he get his head on it? And it's off the crossbar. Oh, Nicolas Sule fighting Mason Greenwood here. What can Greenwood do? Mason Greenwood gets it to Yuri Yellerman, who gets it to Ryan Gravenberch. Gets it over to Diogo Dalot. Dalot's in the box. What can he do here? Chips it over. And Edison hits out for Bruno Fernandes. Brilliant deflection by Nathan Ake. And it's out for another Manchester United corner. Crossed in. Can Ruben Dias get his head on it? No. Ryan Graham Burks running after the ball here. He gets it. Oh. He has to pass it still instead of Diogo Dalot. Roger on the ball. To Nicolas Sula. To Ferland Mendy who gets it to Gabriel Jesus. Fires Raheem Sterling but it's too hard of a hit. And it's Manchester United's corner. Dean Henderson passes it to Milan Skrinar. Gets it to Dean Henderson. Not Dean Henderson. Diogo Dalot. Graven Birch. Yuri Chelemans. And... Chelmans is knocked out, but it's not a free kick. Mahrez. Oh. Gets to Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes. Sees. Sancho's run, but Mendy gets there first. Okay. Gets it to Ferland Mendy. Rodri. To Ake. It's hit over to Raheem Sterling, but it's out. For a Manchester United court. Not called a throw in. Skrinar over to Bruno Fernandes. Oh, Bruno Fernandes over to Yuri Tielemans. It was nearly deflected off of the foot of Rodri. Greenwood gets it to Gravenberg. Gravenberg with a chip to Greenwood. Greenwood, what's he going to do here? Oh, and he, he collides with Edison. But he gets straight up. Top man to Gravenberg. To Jaden Sancho. Sancho to Mason Greenwood. Oh my god! Mason Greenwood with a beautiful curled shot past Edison. You've got to say Greenwood's got to be a big contender for youngster of the season. Young player of the season for Man United, absolutely. It's nearly a certain guarantee. But what a beautiful curl just turns around. One touch and bang! Mason Green was 10th goal and it's Manchester United 3, Manchester City 0. Kevin De Bruyne. And it's half time. Manchester United are currently leading by a big gap. Demnants of the Manchester City game where they beat Man United 6 1. Mahrez has only had 4 touches of the ball this game. With a poor game so far for the Man, Man City forwards. Sterling has been going for runs every now and then, but they're just not sufficing for Man United attack, what Man City attack. But we make a change here. A bit more defensive change. We're going to be bringing Fred on. 
for Graven Birch. And it is the second half underway. Rodri to Bernardo Silva here. But Fernando's trying to chase it down. Bernardo Silva. And it's a tackle by Bruno Fernandes. It's just a word, a warning by the referee. Next time will guarantee be a yellow or a red card. Nathan Ake hits it up. Tries to get to Jesus. But Fred, can he get the ball? No, he's been floored by Kevin De Bruyne. And it is a Man United free kick to Diogo Dalot. Dalot, oh, tries to get to Jadon Sancho. Gets it to Fred. Who gets it to Sancho? Sancho, what can you do here? Oh, it's back to Fred. Two. Diogo Dalot. Diogo Dalot can he get in and Edison catches the ball. Nicolas Sula to Kyle Walker to Rodri who gets it over to Riyad Mahrez. Oh, Pierre Mekabamian on the move. Okay. Bernardo Silva. Oh, Luke Shaw deflects it. Rashford on the run. Can he beat Kyle Walker? Kyle Walker's run out of energy here. It's Rashford. Oh, Luke. Kyle Walker just pushing him off. Kyle Walker now on the ball. Luke Shaw. Beautiful. Gets to Rashford. What's Rashford going to do here? If he turns Bernardo Silva, it looks like he can. Rashford with a rainbow flick and Edison saves it. Beautiful rainbow flick volley as Rashford shoots it and Edison saves it with all of his might. And Rashford with the corner sent in. Can Ruben Dias get his head on it? He does, but it's just over the bar. Passed over to Yao Cancelo, who's, who's been substituted on for Ferland Mendy. Kevin De Bruyne over to Bernardo Silva to Aguero. Oh, Grenard gets the ball to Bruno Fernandes. Fernandes on the ball. Sees Greenwood. Mason Greenwood. From out here. What can you do? Greenwood. Oh, he's going to try it. And it's hit off. Nathan Ake. Ruben Dias, though, to Fred. Fred chips it over, but Niklas Sula gets it out. But it's not over. And Kevin De Bruyne gets it, tried to get it over to Bernardo Silva and Luke Shaw. Gets it back to Ruben Dias. Rashford going past Carl Walker here, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Oh, Rashford gets past his man. What's Rashford going to do here? Oh, Rashford tackles Kevin De Bruyne. But it is an advantage played. Yeah, for that, okay. To Kevin De Bruyne. To Rodney. Over. To Liad Mares. Ruben Dias. Can he stop Mares? And he does. Brilliant ball. Oh. Pass it to Rashford. Rashford's pass Walker here. So the easy part's done. Gets it to Bruno Fernandes, who gets it over to Green, and it's offside. Offside for Bruno Fernandes, and it looks like D'Souza will be brought on for Marcus Rashford here, and Fernandinho will be brought on for Rodri. Kicks over to Fernandinho, actually, to Bernardo Silva. Silva over to Bernardo. Oh, Tay Elements with the nice interception. Bruno Fernandes trying to get to Jenna Sancho. Oh my god. Sterling and Dalot both going for a challenge. But they're both okay. Thank god. Dalot to Jenna Sancho. Can he get past Yal Cancelo and Nicolas Sula? Looks like he is. Turns. Oh, Sancho. Uh, still 3-0 here Kevin De Bruyne gets it to Kun Aguero Aguero over to Bernardo Silva and also like Mares on his own Luke Shaw to Kyle Walker not Luke Mares to Kyle Walker 
Mares over to Bernardo Silva, and it's off the post. Is it off the post here? Pep Guardiola frustrated. Obviously, he has a right to be. He's getting demolished by Man United today. Luke Shaw. Can he get it to anyone here? To Bruno Fernandes, but it's intercepted by Fernandinho. He gets it to De Bruyne, who gets it over to Mares. No, Luke Shaw hits it out to Pavard, who gets it to Fred and Jellemans. That attack is broken down, but Man United go for the counter attack here. Bruno Fernandes sees Fred, Jadon Sancho on the ball, and it's off the crossbar. Jadon Sancho hits the ball off the crossbar in a last-ditch effort to get a 4-0 lead to Manchester City. Bruno Fernandes though to Fred, back to Bruno Fernandes. Sees Greenwood, can Greenwood turn his man? Gets it back to Bruno Fernandes, Fernandes with the chip, but Oh, Greenwood nearly took out the goalkeeper. Two minutes of added time. And this looks like it will be Man United crowned Premier League champions. It's offside for Greenwood, but that doesn't matter. As this will be the moment that Man United lift their 21st Premier League title. All we've worked for this entire season has come to fruition as Manchester United are Premier League champions once more. The 21st Premier League title for Manchester United extending their Premier League title wins over Liverpool to two. And they beat Liverpool to the Premier League title of all teams. And what better way to win it than at a Manchester derby. As we see the Man United team coming up to take the Premier League title. Last time we seen ribbons like that was 2013. The entire Manchester United squad here. Bruno Fernandes, probably the man who single-handedly got every attack going. And... Man United are once again Premier League champions. What a day. Mark this date. The 8th of April 2021 as the day that Manchester United win the Premier League title for the first time in eight years. I'm so proud of the boys for putting 100% into every single game. <laughs> we have deserved this. We needed this. What a time to be alive as a Manchester United fan. And that's the boys that made it possible. Brilliant season by all of them. Granted some of them didn't play all the time. But I'm glad to call my boys at Manchester United. Premier League champions. Once more. I am just... I am proud to be a Man United fan right now and to be the manager who took them to the Premier League title this season. Liverpool can no longer mathematically win the title, so it's ours, baby. If we lost that match, it would have gone down to the last match of the season. It's a quick couple of questions. Satisfied. Uh, yeah, I, I can't speak highly enough of the players who have played this season. Uh, yeah. This is not just for me, this is for all of us.
we have gone through this series, ups and downs. Let's have a look at the results, shall we? We have lost two games, seven draws, and 28 wins, with a, with a 68 goal difference, 97 goals for us, 29 goals against us, put in the back of our net. That is incredible. We've scored the most goals by far, by 24 goals. And if you just look down this entire list, no one compares to our record. I'm just tremendously proud of what we've done today. The last game of the season is against Southampton. Greenwood, brilliant striker, and he's clinched the Premier League title for us. And with one game left to spare, and the Champions League, we can now pretty much confirm that Timo Werner is going to get the gold of boom. Harry Kane in fifth. That is a bit disappointing. He's tied with Raheem Sterling. But I hope the boys enjoyed enjoy this title win because this is what we need as a team at Man United this season in real life. But the, the season ain't done. One game left. And you cannot deny that Southampton are not going to have an easy time against the Premier League champions. Oh, got scouting reports. Melbourne, they said it yet. We still got to do the Champions League final and player of the season, goal of the season, youngs of the season, and transfer of the season. So don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. You're fucking blind. You can't see me. But, obviously, Southampton's next, and we're going to kick their asses. And, if we win, we'll end the season on 94 points. Six points off Manchester City's 100-point season. But, I think this is a successful season for the United boys that are playing in the Red Devil. So I'll quickly send this, uh, we should win 2 0. 3 1, technically 2 0. But yeah. The finals first place Manchester United against the second placed Liverpool. Obviously, the entire Premier League season was probably decided by the game against Liverpool in January. So, Liverpool do want to get their revenge. Bruno Fernandes is suspended. Oh no. That's fucking shite. But, skip ahead to the Liverpool game in the Champions League final. Hopefully we win this, because then we will have a treble, technically. We won the FL Cup. We won the Premier League. So that's a double. Let's see if we can get a domestic treble. For the first time since 1999, can the Manchester United team get a treble 
full stop. Let's just go to Youth Academy and re, re up some players. Promote. Ah, it's full. That's why. My fucking team's full, mate. I can't promote any of you twats. Alright, player chat. You want to go and go for this Champions League? Fuck off. I'm sorry, Lee Grant, but I can't play with this final. We need to play the best team that we have. At least Bruno Fernandes can play this final, at least. Alex Teller's got up front. No, not up front. Uh, like that. And we can finally bring back Donny Van der Beek. Jalen yeah, Sancho's got operated. Uh, All right. I think this is the group of players I want to go to the Champions League final with. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to attend a press conference. Thank you for your patience. We'll start taking questions now. All right, give me some questions then. You've already lifted the Premier League trophy. A remarkable double. All right. Uh, I trust my players to get the job done. Yep, yeah, absolutely. We'll be in the mood to beat their asses, definitely. It's a little poor. We can't let them run away with this. Uh, this is ours. A massive final, yeah. Well, friends, we always do a few tactical changes, obviously. That's all we have time for today. But there is one key tactical change I want to make. I've seen in a couple of career modes that this definitely helps out Jadon Sancho. Let's go to roles, not ta instructions, sorry. And put him on. Get behind a uh, free run. Whilst Rashford can cut inside and target man. I don't know what the full. I don't know how you do instructions. That's why I don't do much of them. But this is it. Ladies and gentlemen, Manchester United versus Liverpool in the Champions League the final. Let's get into it. This is it, ladies and gentlemen. I am nervous, but also excited at the same time. The Champions League final. Is underway at the Arsenal Olympiad study, which I think is in Turkey. And that trophy is what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen. The Champions League. Is it coming to Man United or Liverpool? I see my United's road was definitely a bit easier than Liverpool's. They had faced face PSG, Chelsea and Barcelona, whilst we faced Lazio, and Sevilla and Atalanta. Granted, the games we played were easy. Weren't easy. But they weren't. They were easily going to come by the overpowering presence of Manchester United. Here we go, Liverpool's team 
Line it up is a traditional 4-3-3 false nine. And here's how it looks. The front three of Salah, Mane, Firmino still strong. Captain John Henson will be leading the team to glory as they hope today. But here we go. The local team get their photo as Champions League finalists. And that's all they'll be as we will be Champions League winners today, ladies and gentlemen. As, as we look at my United squad, stacked with stars. Obviously, the goalkeeper, Dean Henson, has been on roll recently. But you cannot deny that front four of Rashford, Fernandes, Sancho and Werner are going to decimate the defence of Liverpool today. As we get ready for the Champions League final, Manchester United takes on Liverpool in the biggest derby in football in history but it's even bigger because it's at a Champions League final and it's already a free kick to Liverpool as Rashford a bit too aggressive taking the ball off of Fabian there Gomez whips it in Van der Beek hit, heads it out and Gomez gets the ball back to Fabian to Firmino and Mobilaz could now stop him and he does gets it to Rashford but Alexander-Arnold intercepts it's to Arnold here and Tellez with the interception Rashford looks like he can run free here if no one catches him that is what's Rashford going to do cuts outside oh gets past and Rashford close to scoring there just too much curve and too much power on the ball Pass to Virgil van Dijk. Joe Gomez. Alexander Arnold. Rashford hits it out for a Liverpool throw in. Alexander Arnold hits it to Joe Gomez. Gets it to Fabinho. To Mohamed Salah. Fabinho here. But Ruben Dias gets the ball to Van der Beek. Who gets it to Jaden Sancho. Sancho gets past Andrew Robertson. Sancho's on a run here, but Robertson keeping at arm's, at arm's length to Jadon Sancho here. Oh, Sancho tries to get it, but Virgil van Dijk, the block of wall he is, gets in the way, as it looks like. Sadio Mane is on a run here, tries to get it in, but Ruben Dias gets it out. Van der Beek heads it down, Rashford receives the ball, and he's on a run here again. Just his out wide runs. Oh, Rashford trying to turn his man. Off comes with it as Fabinho. To Fabian. Over to Mohamed Salah, but it's out for a Man United throw in. Rashford on the ball. Can he get past Alexander Arnold? No. Alex Tellers hits it out though. And. Back to Van Dyke. Joe Gomez. Bruno Fernandes nearly got the ball there. And it's Alexander Arnold. To Fabian. To Mohamed Salah. Oh, can Bruno Fernandes get the ball? No. To Gomez. To Fabinho. Oh. To Elements. Gets the interception. To Bruno Fernandes. Who chips it over to Marcus Rashford. Marcus Rashford on the ball here. If he get past Fabian. Looks like he can. Rashford with the rainbow flick. Oh my god! Rashford close again to scoring after a beautiful rainbow flick. Gets it over Alexander Arnold, but it doesn't get it high enough to get in the goal or make contact with the goal. I also pass it to Van Dyke. To Joe Gomez. The video. Oh, Van der Beek takes it down, but referees play an advantage. Bobby Firmino now to Jordan Henderson. Oh, and it's a tackle there. And Rashford on the run again. Oh, Rashford gets it past one man. Rashford with the rainbow flick. Rashford! What a save by Arson. Beautiful shot by Rashford, but it's straight at the keeper. It's out for a corner. 
flowed in. Ruben Dias. And Alisson hits it out. Rashford runs for it. Rashford collects it. Gets Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes with the curl. And Alisson. Safe hands there. Like he has been all season. Alexander Arnold to Fabian. To Fabinho. Back to Mohamed Salah. Fabian. Oh, tell us for the interception. Tell us, throw the ball. What can you do here? Gets it back to T Element. And it is out for a Manchester United throw in. Thrown over to Ruben Dias. We pass it back to the goalkeeper of Dean Henderson. To Blanc Renard. To Ruben Dias. To Yuri Elements. Timo Werner. Gets it to Rashford. Rashford turns his man. Going on a run here. Rashford. Rainbow flicks Virgil van Dijk. Oh, and Robertson gets the ball. Not Robertson. Henderson. Gets it to Robertson. Who gets back to Henderson to Virgil van Dijk. And it's over to Sadio Mane. Can Benjamin Pavard catch him? Not looking likely. And he curls it in. And Swinar heads it. Jordan Henderson. Gets it to Sadio Mane. Back to Henderson. And Swinar. Just the block of wall that he is. Gets it. Oh, Rashford tried to get to Tellez. And Tellez with the tackle. Advantage played again. Chipped over to Mohamed Salah who tries to get it in for... Bobby Firmino, but it is a yellow card for Tellers for the tackle earlier. As Tellers heads it out to Timo Werner, who gets it to Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes finds out what he does. He gets to Jadon Sancho. Can Sancho go running here? Sancho. Oh, and Robertson gets the ball. And it looks to be half time. And it is. The scoreline currently. It's. No goal so far in the first half. We are goalless. Big good performances by both teams. Just capitalising on the poor defending so far by the win backs of Pavard and Alexander Arnold. But let's hope we can have a better second half. Let's get right into it as Werner kicks off the second half. Pass it to Benjamin Pavard. Who gets it over to Yuri Tielemans. Gets it to Bruno Fernandes. To Donny van der Beek. Who gets it over to Jadon Sancho. Sancho gets past Andrew Robertson here. Sancho had to go. Here. Sancho he's in. But Allison with the save. And it's a free kick as Sancho knocks down Allison. Allison just full on pelting it down the field. Rashford with the header. And Alex Tellers gets the ball. Gets it to Ruben Dias. Who gets it to Milan Squinar. Over to Van der Beek. To Bruno Fernandes. To Yuri Tielemans. Who gets it to Rashford. Rashford can he turn out to Arnold? No. It's over to Mohamed Salah. No. Salah does get the ball though in the end. Gets it to Fabian. But Tielemans with the interception. Gets it to Pavard. No. Mane with the interception. Oh. We've got Diash with the ball here. Who we'll gets to Milan Squidar? Get it to Benjamin Pavard here. Oh, hit over. And it is a Manchester United throw in. And a change being made for local side as Fabian has been taken off for Thiago. Pavard throws it over to Jadon Sancho. Sancho got past Mane here. Can he get past Robertson? No, Andy Robertson tried to stop him, but Sancho still going for it. Oh, Sancho with a rainbow foot there. Gets it over. Get a Sancho! And it's saved by Allison. Beautiful rainbow flick over Fabinho. It's a beautiful strike, but Allison too good in the in the goalposts here today. And it's floated in. Pavard. Oh. Back on to Rashford though. Oh. 
Henderson gets the ball to Alexander Arnold to Thiago. Looks like they're going on the counter attack here. Bobby Firmino gets it over to Alexander Arnold. Gets it to Salah. And it's back to Firmino. Back to Salah. Alan Skrinar gets the ball. Can he get to Fernandes? No. Henderson over to Mane. To Bobby Firmino. To Mohamed Salah. Back to Henderson. And it's gone over for a Manchester United goal kick. Kick to Ruben Dias here. Who gets it over to Alex Tellez. Tellez gets it to Yuri Tielemans. Over to Donny van der Beek. Van der Beek to Timo Werner. Werner. Can you find Rashford? Rashford's over. Not offside. Oh, it is offside. They'll probably just buy a, a, a hair then. But we'll be taking off Pavard for Diogo Dalot here. Pavard's done his job today. But it's time for the big boys to do their work. And it's floated in. Van der Beek with the header. It's gone to Fabinho. To Robertson to go back. Fabinho, it's over, and Salah is on, crosses it in, and a beautiful save by Dean Henderson, who throws it to Diogo Dalla. Oh, Sancho turns Robertson, Sancho's on a run, Sancho, Sancho's just going here, Sancho cannot be stopped, Sancho with the rainbow flick, Sancho! Ginter to Thiago to Fabinho to Firmino and it's Salah on the ball oh over to Mane oh Van der Beek with the block Robertson now to Thiago Diash gets a beautiful tackle in oh Van der Beek to Sancho who gets it to Ruben uh, to Bruno Fernandes Oh, and Fernandes has been backed up in the corner here. And can he get to Dalot to Sancho? Sancho's on a run here. Just come back in the defence. Oh, with a rainbow flick. And it's out over to the other Dalot. Werner on the ball! Gelman's to Van der Beek. Getting it to Rashford. What can Rashford do here? Rashford. Rashford's on it. Oh, Rashford. Shot too late there. We are nearing the end of full time. There's Mane going on the run here. Can he get past Milan Skunar? Henderson on the ball. Van der Beek gets it. Over to Bruno Fernandes who chips it over to Jadon Sancho. Sancho's on the run. Sancho turns. Andy Robertson. Sancho with the rainbow flick and it's over to Allison who gets the ball and it's kicked oh Firmino to Tielemans who gets through Fernandes to Rashford oh free kick this could be it and it's curled in but it's saved by Allison. Road to Ozzy Kabak. Oh, Dalot gets it over to Bruno Fernandes who gets it to Timo Werner. Werner, and it's another free kick. It's a tackle by Ginter, and it's a red card. A red card for Matthias Ginter. This could be the goal, the free kick to send them through. Rashford digs it in and Allison saves it. Looks like he's going for a knuckleball there. Sancho heads it to Bruno Fernandes and it's off. Greenwood, can he get the ball? Greenwood, no, Allison gets it and it is full time. Nil nil at the end of it all. The Champions League final for the fourth time in its history will be going to extra time. 
It's been a good game by both teams. Liverpool have not had a shot on target whilst United have had 15. But here we go. First half of extra time. Correa to Henderson. To Thiago back to Henderson. To Fabinho. Thiago. Over to Salah. Salah back to Thiago. Oh, Thiago's going for it. But he's tackled by Tellers. But Rashford gets it. Jumps over Thiago to Van der Beek. To Bruno Fernandes. Greenwood. Can he find Sancho? Sancho's on the ball here. Sancho runs. Oh, and it's, he's down, but he's not free kick. My guy plays have to compose and get back in here. And it's chipped over to Sadio Mane. Diogo Dalot left it open. Correa here. Gets it over to Mane, and it's a beautiful tackle. People are calling for it to be a penalty, but it's not. Correa chipped it in and Henderson with the save. Van der Beek to Bruno Fernandes who gets it to Tielemans. Can he get it to Rashford? No. Oh, to Rashford now. Oh, and Rashford's down. Bruno Diaz here. Oh, Mohamed Salah. And here we go. Tielemans. Gets it over to Dalot who gets it to Jadon Sancho. Sancho, can he get past Henderson? Looks likely. Oh, Sancho shoots! No, Rashford tried to go for the header. And it's gone to Thiago. Gets to Fabinho, to Thiago. Thiago to Correa. Oh, Tielemans gets the ball and it is half time of extra time. This is getting close. 15 more minutes of football. This is getting sketchy. Second half of extra time is underway. With a finish passage back to Greenwood. To Rashford. Rashford's got a little bit of a run here. Rashford, can he get past? He's getting past the defenders here. Rashford. Oh my god. Come back. Over to Henderson. Mane's going for a little bit of a run here. Mane got the ball. To Kabak. To Mane. And Squadar tackles. Nice tackle there. Oh, to Pavinio. Had to bait with a tackle again. And it is a free kick. Mane. Well. You let go to a proper free kick here. It's floated in. Oh, Thiago to Correa. Gets to Mane, to Henderson. To Salah. To Mane, but it is headed down. And over to Rashford. Rashford with the ball here. Outside to Ronald. Trying to trip him up there, but nothing happens. Oh, Rashford, can he get past Thiago? Looks like he is. Rashford. Rashford tried to get it, Bruno Fernandes! Oh my god, Fernandes! Nearly got the goal, but it hits. Alisson's water bottle. Four minutes left of football before penalties if no one scores. Robertson to Henderson. Henderson over to Mane to Correa. Oh, and it's a tackle. Could this be by United's attack? Gets it over to Bruno Fernandes, but it looks like Alisson's going to get the ball. It looks like this could be it. Two minutes of playing time left. Dalot heads it over. Oh, Sancho's on the ball here. Get a Sancho, and he's tackled, but nothing comes of it. Looks like this could be it. And this is it. It's coming down to penalties. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen. It's come down to this. Penalties.
Here we go. First up, Fabinho. And he's gone left. We go left as well, but Alisson saves it. And, oh, Salah misses. And Marshall with the chip. Oh, Thiago goes left. Oh, Tellers goes bottom right. Oh, and Marty does the same. Your Chalabans here. Goes left. Could this be it? Henderson with the penalty. Oh! It hits off Henderson's head. Here we go. Two. If Mason Greenwood misses this, Man United have lost the Champions League and he gets it in. Alexander Arnold goes right and he misses. It's off the post. Jaden Sancho has to score for Man United to win. The Champions League and Allison saves it. Robertson goes right and Henderson saves. Again, the last chance. Donny van der Beek. Can he do it? And he goes straight at the keeper. Correa goes right and Henderson saves. This has got to be it now. Milan Skrinar. With the penalty. Bottom right and we've done it! Manchester United win the Champions League on penalties. Let's go! Milan Svodar with the crucial goal. Bottom right. Alisson goes left. And Manchester United have secured the Champions League. Brilliant attempt. Man United with 5-4 on penalties. Liverpool in distraught as Man United again picked them to another trophy. And there could be none more important than this one. The Champions League. Another trophy to add to the Manchester United cabinet. This is their fourth. Champions League trophy. <sighs> we said we wanted that trophy and we came and got it. It came down to penalties. And Milan Skrinar with the crucial, crucial penalty to win us the Champions League. And here we go. We are Champions League winners. Manchester United once again lift the Champions League trophy and make it their fourth Champions League. Way! Crucial win for Man United. As we've seen, Man United going around the stadium with the trophy. Never thought we'd be winning the Champions League in the first season. As we see the captain Bruno Fernandes with it. Uh, hey! <laughs> Congratulations to Manchester United. We have won the Champions League. But commiserations to Liverpool. Brilliant effort today, but just didn't make it. Can Alexander Arnold hit the penalty off the post for us to win? And I could not be more happy.
But do the interview, I'll give you the player, transfer, young player and goal of the season. Actually, no goals this season. I'll just give you these three. And I'll let you vote on them on Twitter, which I'll leave down below in the link in the description. And you'll see the link, uh, you'll see the polls. But... Is it alright if we just ask you a couple of questions? The double, at the start of the season. Thank you, that's all the... At the start of the season, I didn't think we'd win any trophy. But we have now. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. But before you go, for Young Player of the Season, I have two, I have two people of each, and you have to vote on one. So option one is Mason Greenwood, and option two is Ahmad Diallo. Transfer of the season, option one is Jaden Sancho, and option two is Thibaut Werner. Now finally, player of the season, option one, Marcus Rashford, and option two, the captain, Bruno Fernandes. By the time this video goes out, I'll put the polls up and you'll be able to vote within two to three days. And then I'll do season two, episode one. And yes. But, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for season one of the Manchester United career mode. And what a journey it has been. I could not be happier with the results. Champions League and Premier League coming home to the Red Devils. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching. And until season two, take care and peace.